Hello everyone. Welcome to my channel Joyce's Story Treasury. Today we are going to read a book that is B Makes Tea by Asborn Phonics Reader written by Leslie Sims and Fred Blunt. Asborn has many books in this Phonics Reader series and in coming days we will be reading them too. Uh, this is a small thin book and it has a short and sweet little story. It focuses on specific sound groups and it is surely going to help your children to read on their own. So let's go to the story. B makes D by Leslie Sims and Fred Blunt. Meet B. B lives beside the sea. Today she is all a flutter. For its Queen Bee's birthday tea. Bee buzzes home and starts to bake. Soon her rooms fill up with cake. Chocolate cheesecakes on the chairs. Cherry cupcakes up the stairs. Pies piled high with plums and pears. Ant runs in and grins with glee. You're making tea for my Queen Bee. Her birthday tea is by the sea. I've planned a grand tea on the sand. It must go well. Can I lend a hand? They take up cups and fill the pot. B starts to frown. It looks a lot. Oh, Ant, how will I carry that? Wait here, says Ant. I'll soon be back. He finds his friends and lines them up. They carry cakes and plates and cups. Two take the milk, three take the pot. Look out, calls B. That tea is hot. Wow, says Ant. That cake is tall. Be careful now. Don't let it fall. Speed up, shouts Ant. Move that cake faster. Then one ant slips and trips. Disaster. Oh no! Bee cries. She sobs and sighs. That was my queen bee's big surprise. The queen will be so mad with me. She'll say that I am a bad, bad bee. Collect it all. Ant tells his team. Now, quick bee, whip some buttercream. You need to use the cream like glue. See, stuck together, good as new. The queen bee gasps and laughs. He <laughs> he, a special cake that looks like me. Thank you for my birthday tea. And that's the end of our story. I hope you like the story. So kindly like, share, comment, and subscribe. Bye bye.